Hello guys, I will show you free pink items to get. To obtain the avatar item in this game, you must first fill up this book with 11 stamps. Follow me. Interact with each poster on this map to collect the stamps. After collecting the 11th stamp, you will receive the badge and the avatar item. Now let's check our inventory. To obtain the coffee bean bucket hat, you must collect three coins that are hidden throughout the map. Follow me. Go through the floor is refreshing portal. Continue walking straight ahead to reach the tree house. The first coin is at the end of the tree house obby. This obby is simple. Here it is. Let's now obtain the second coin. Go through this portal. The coin is on the lifeguard chair. Reset your character and let's obtain the third coin. Go through the speed run portal. Turn your camera around and go where it says start. Here is the third coin. Let's check our inventory. To obtain the NARS Afterglow Macaron Newsy hat, you must collect 10 style assets on the color garden board. This game is similar to Monopoly. If you're not familiar with Monopoly, simply roll the dice and the number that comes up will decide how many blocks you move. There is a dice hanging over your head. Simply jump to roll the dice. Your character will move to the specified block automatically. When you land at a style asset, purchase it. You must purchase 10 of these. Continue rolling the dice. You will land on various items such as coins, power-ups, and so on. Our main concern is to collect enough coins and purchasing style assets. Each style asset costs 30 coins. You will eventually run out of money and dice rolls. Join a minigame when this happens. As soon as the minigame begins, you will immediately teleport there.
There are different minigames, most of them are simple. And I recommend playing on a private server because you will always win first place, and it's for free. When you complete the minigame, you will receive coins and dice rolls. When you purchase the 10th style asset, you will receive a badge and the avatar item. To obtain the NARS Afterglow Blushback accessory, you must collect 10 style assets on the Blush Rush Cake Board. Click on boards to teleport to the Blush Rush Cake Board. There is a dice hanging over your head. Simply jump to roll the dice. Your character will move to the specified platform automatically. When you land at a style asset, purchase it. You must purchase 10 of style assets to obtain the avatar item. And each style asset cost 30 coins. Continue rolling the dice. You will land on different items, such as coins, power-ups, and so on. Our main concern is to collect enough coins to purchase the 10 style assets. You will eventually run out of money and dice rolls. Join a minigame when this happens. And I recommend playing on a private server, because you will always win first place. And it's for free. When you complete the minigame, you will receive coins and dice rolls. When you purchase the 10th style asset, you will receive the badge and the avatar item. To obtain the NARS Kiss Cross Body Bag, you must complete one of the weekly tasks. If you previously obtained the NARS Afterglow Macaron Newsy Hat, you will receive the bag right away. So I recommend that you get the hat first, and I'll leave a tutorial link to it below. Also, I recommend playing on a private server because it is free and has less glitches. So to view the weekly tasks, click the Tasks button. and complete one of these weekly tasks. The quickest tasks are collecting five style assets and traveling 100 board spaces. Click on claim after you complete the task to get the item. To obtain the NAR Strawberry Sweets headband, go to the Shimmer Patisserie board. Then collect 10 style assets to obtain the item. Jump to roll the dice, and you will automatically move to the specified place. You'll come across different items. When you land on a style asset, purchase it. You have to purchase 10 of these. Style assets cost 30 coins each. Continue rolling the dice and purchasing the style assets. Play minigames to earn coins if you run out of them. Most of the minigames are easy to play. I also suggest playing in a private server. When you purchase the 10th style asset, you will receive the avatar item. After you join the game, go through the Garden Galaxis portal.
To obtain the lotus hat, use the metal detector to find it. Only one person on the server can get it at a time, and it is not possible to do so in a private server. To move faster, I recommend using a hoverboard and use the checkpoint icon to travel faster between areas to find the item. Travel to each location and listen to the beeping. Also, zoom out to see if you can spot the lotus. I'll show you where the lotus spawns most frequently after I find it. It's right here, I can see it on the statue. Now, I will show you where the lotus spawns most frequently, the first location is at checkpoint 1. The lotus hat will frequently spawn on this statue. The second location is at checkpoint 3. The lotus hat will frequently spawn on this big lotus. The third location is at checkpoint 6. The lotus hat will frequently spawn on these five plants. This greenhouse is the final location. After you join the game, go through the jungle jiffy portal. To obtain the lotus racer, you must win 5 races. Stand on the green area to join a race and wait for the current race to end. Then you must wait for the next race to begin. Each race has 4 laps. The player who completes the 4 laps first wins the race. Try to collect the blue glowing lotus. It will boost your speed. And try not to drive on the bananas on the ground. They will slow down your car and make you lose control. On the top left of the screen, you can view your racing place. When you win your first race, you will receive a badge. To obtain the avatar item, you must win for more times. In addition, even if you switch servers, you will not lose your progress. So to obtain the hair, you must find 5 letters of the word twice. I'll show you where you can find them. Now teleport to Twice Pier and ride the Ferris wheel. Then jump from here. 
Now let's get the last letter. In this experience we will obtain three items, they are all easy to get. Follow me to obtain the first avatar item. Cross this bridge. Now go behind this building. Continue walking until you reach the back side of the building. Get this key. Then click on take me there, but it disappeared quickly, so I'll walk. Enter the concert building. Once you enter the bedroom, you will obtain the sleepy pajamas. Now let's get the second avatar item. Enter the closet room and play the dress up minigame. Play the game if you wish, but winning isn't important. When your chances run out, you will receive the item. So I'll just keep losing on purpose. Once you finish, you will obtain the poster girl record. To get the third item, reset your character or return to the spawn point. Then go to the lake. Start and finish the boat race. All you need to do is pass through the blue ring. Once you finish the race, you will obtain a headband. Let's take a look at the avatar items we obtained. The pajamas and headband are adorable. You need to train a staff member in order to obtain the pink cat ear headphones. Follow me. Once the greeter is unlocked, interact with her and train a staff. To obtain the wings, you must first play the tycoon until you purchase the office button.
To obtain the hair, you must purchase all of the buttons. This is the last button.